and eight cell phone images of the man accused of killing four people in Groton. Moments before, he's accused of knocking on neighbor's door, naked, covered in mud, saying he had just committed murder. Police are calling this a horrific act of family violence, but a motive is still unclear tonight. WBZ's Paul Burton reports that neighbor who opened up the door is still shaken. He says, I need help, I need help, and then he adds, I murder four people. Wagner Alcoser says he could not believe what he was witnessing. A naked man at his back door Groton home saying he just committed a horrible crime. State police arrested 22-year-old Orion Krauss and charged him with four counts of murder after a man and three women were found dead at this home on Common Street. I asked him, where are you clothes? And he says, I left it in the woods. And he repeated again, I murdered four people. Police are calling this an act of tragic family violence. Middlesex DA's office says the victims are an elderly man and woman along with two middle-aged women. All four died of blunt trauma. Very nice elderly couple. You know, they have a beautiful home with gorgeous gardens. Wagner says when Krauss came to him, he was acting very strange and covered in mud. Wagner said he gave the man a white blanket and told him to wait outside on this chair and immediately called police who placed him under arrest. It's extremely calm. He never raised his voice. He, he surrendered himself. Wow. He didn't resist. He did what I asked. He followed my instructions. All throughout the day, neighbors and passerbys could not believe the gruesome scene and police presence, but glad police say this was an isolated incident and not a random act. We're all touched by this um, in some way, and my thoughts and prayers are with the family, the neighbors, um, anybody close to them. Very sad, shocking that um, innocent people had to go through such a horrendous deaths. Police are still investigating. So far, no word on a motive. Krauss will be arraigned on Monday. In Groton, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.